And what I've been reading is this post here from A. Parnas. In edit mode, click on the appropriate view, etc. I'm going to follow these instructions. I've had no success yet, but that doesn't mean it won't work this time. I'm going to edit this application. And I'm going to records, set filters. And views, expense form. Records, set filters. Now, <clears throat> I'm going to create uh, this filter. Filter lets you see only records you need. So okay, I'm going to create auto filters if, you, if your form has drop down field. You can also create custom fields with criteria. So I'm going to create a new custom filter. I'm going to call this business, which is going to uh, filter all entries that have that are connected to business and the reason spent equals or contains the word business now I wonder if I can add uh, wild cards here there's not much help in this interface so I'm just gonna go with what I have already click Save now you can see that the database is not updated I just doesn't show any filters doesn't show any custom filters but you can see I have a filter here so I'm gonna go ahead and click done and what I'll do is I'll go back to my filters and see if it's there hey it's still there and it shows as one custom filter good so now let's go read the instructions New custom you specify, blah, blah, blah. Click done on the button, access this application, and click on the required view. Access this application. And click on the required view. There's default filters. Uh, I'm not getting my filter. Let's try this home test whatever that is filter business okay it looks like it worked I'm very happy about that uh, I can see that business is where it was supposed to be so that's how to check on your um, how to create filters thanks for watching and happy computing